Ukrainian forces are using buggy-type vehicles sporting roof-mounted Stugna P anti-tank guided missile systems in their ongoing fight against Russian armor. Mounted on trucks, fired from the ground, or launched from the shoulder, ATGMs have become an iconic weapon in this war, though there are many types being deployed against Russian armor. Ukraine has domestic ATGM production of missiles, like the Stugna P, but has also made extensive use of imported variants. The buggies in question have shown up several times on social media, as far back as 2019, before the current Russian offensive, sometimes topped with weapons and other times not. Several photos of the all-terrain two-seater vehicles made the rounds on social media earlier this week. Likely a Polaris Ranger, MRZR Alpha, or some vehicle of equivalent size, the buggies are relatively inexpensive transports for small units that pack a serious punch with the inclusion of the Stugna P. The missiles are made by Ukraine's own state key of design bureau Luch. The basic Ranger UTV only has 32 horsepower, but is capable of pulling 1,500 pounds and has a 10-inch ground clearance. U.S. military personnel and civilians stationed overseas can pick up a Polaris Ranger SP with a larger 44-horsepower engine through the Army and Air Force Exchange Service for just under $12,000. Armed with Ukrainian-made Stugna P anti-tank system, the small buggies are a swift, potent weapon in rough terrain. The missiles are capable of engaging both ground vehicles and even, under some circumstances, low-flying slow aircraft, including attack helicopters. The Stugna P, also called the Skiff, is designed to destroy manpower and stationary and mobile modern armored targets with combined, carried or monolithic armor including explosive reactive armor and also pinpoint targets like weapon emplacements, lightly armored objects and hovered helicopters at any time of day or night. ATGMs built domestically and donated by European nations and the U.S. have become iconic in this current conflict and wreaked havoc on Russian tanks so far in the seven-week war. U.S.-made Javelin missiles have become sainted, at least in popular culture, for their role in destroying Russian tanks and armored vehicles, but there are concerns over whether production can keep up with demand. Some of the missile systems can be seen outfitted with thermal sights that allow the operator to see enemy vehicles at night or when hidden. The Stugna P missiles can be guided manually through a remote terminal or in semi-automatic command to line of sight setup where the missile is directed via a laser beam aimed at the intended target. The missiles can carry different warheads, including tandem types designed to bust through explosive reactive armor, as well as high explosive fragmentation and thermobaric payloads. Usually fired from a tripod on the ground, the Stugna P system requires a crew of two to four troops. It also can be fired and operated remotely from up to 50 meters via duct the television surveillance and aiming system, which can be seen in some of the photos of the dune buggy mounted systems.